If a vehicle is damaged beyond repair and has any undeployed airbag modular seat belt pre-tensioners, they must all be deployed prior to disposing of the vehicle. Always refer to assist for proper disposal procedures. If the undeployed airbags are still installed in the vehicle, it is easiest to deploy the airbag remotely using harness adapters. This is an essential tool and should be readily available for use. Move the vehicle outdoors with an open space of 20 feet on all sides to deploy airbag modules and seat belt pre-tensioners while mounted in the vehicle. Disconnect the vehicle battery and wait 3 minutes. Attach the appropriate harness adapter from the deployment kit to the airbag to be deployed. For maximum personal safety, do not attempt to modify an existing harness. Clear the area and extend the harness to its maximum length for safety. No one should be in the vehicle or near the airbag during this phase of activity. All personnel in the immediate area should stand at least 16 feet away from the deployment component. Connect the harness to a fully charged 12 volt battery. Caution! The battery must show a voltage of 9.6 volts or more. The deployment tool indicator mark. Deployment tool power should glow green. If it is glowing red, reverse the connection to the battery. After ensuring the area is clear, and while wearing eye and ear protection, press the button on the deployment tool to deploy. Disconnect the tool from the battery immediately after the bag has deployed and leave the airbag module unattended for 30 minutes after deployment. If additional airbag modules need to be deployed, they may be done one after the other by following this procedure for the remaining modules. When deploying seat belt pre-tensioners in the vehicle, leave them unattended for more than 10 minutes after deployment. After deployment of all airbags and pre-tensioners is completed, remove the harness adapters. When deploying airbag and seat belt pre-tensioners outside of the vehicle, follow the service manual procedure to ensure it is done safely. Using wire of at least 1 mm in diameter, secure the airbag module to the airbag module bracket. Firmly secure the airbag module bracket with the airbag module attached in a vise. After clearing the area and from a minimum distance of at least 16 feet, use the deployment tool to deploy the airbag. Again, allow the airbag module to cool for at least 30 minutes before handling it. Place the spent module in a plastic bag and dispose of it after it is cold. For side airbags, remove the airbag module from the seat back using the dimensions stated in the service manual. Drill two holes in the module bracket and firmly secure the bracket to a vise. Attach the side airbag module to the bracket with the studs facing down, using two M6 nuts to secure it. Use the deployment tool to deploy the airbag after the area is safely cleared and you are a minimum of 16 feet away. After 30 minutes of cool down, dispose of the module as previously noted. Following the procedures in the service manual, remove the inflator from the airbag module. Place the inflator with the deployment harness connected into an unmounted tire. Place the tire with the inflator on top of another unmounted tire and another unmounted tire on top of that. Then, place a mounted tire and wheel on top. Using come along strap, secure the tire together in order to keep them standing. Clear the area for safety, and from a distance of at least 16 feet, use the deployment tool to deploy the inflator. 
Again, wait at least 30 minutes before handling the inflator. Then, wrap the spent inflator in plastic and dispose of it. To deploy seat belt pre-tensioners outside of the vehicle, mount the seat belt assembly in a vise. Cut the webbing off. Connect the deployment tool harness to the pre-tensioners. Clear the area for safety. And from a minimum distance of 16 feet. Deploy the pre-tensioner. Allow the assembly to cool for at least 10 minutes before handling. Then, place the pre-tensioner in a plastic bag and dispose of it.